Before the age of calculators, this is what Chinese people used to do their sums. They'd move the beads on the abacus following certain rules. Each bead in the upper deck equals 5, and those in the lower deck equals 1. For example, if I do 5 plus 1, this is 6. And if I plus 12, this is 18. Calculating with beads. Zhu Suan, or the knowledge and practice of arithmetic calculation using the abacus, has a history of over 1800 years. The Chinese invention is considered as the world's most ancient computer. The abacus can perform addition, subtraction, division, and multiplication, and can obtain square roots, cubic roots, and Gauss equation. For centuries, the abacus was a major calculating device. It even helped to make calculations when China developed its first nuclear bomb in the 1960s. But now only some banks and shops use them as a supplement to computers. But very few people learn how to use the abacus now. Until the 1990s, abacus lessons were compulsory in primary schools. Later, they became a selective subject and then it was totally removed from the curriculum. But abacus operation has developed into mental calculation. Some children learn this as an interest. Learners figure out results with an abacus in mind, and there are national contests. The mental calculation is amazing. It helped me do sums really quickly. Advocates of the practice say mental calculation can help improve children's intelligence. Those children are amazing. They can do additions on many numbers in one second. Today, the abacus is still an auspicious symbol of wisdom and wealth. In 2008, it was listed as a national intangible cultural heritage. People in the abacus association hope the valuable heritage won't die. CCTV, Beijing.